What is up guys and welcome to the 91 rated Prime Icon Michael Ballat Play Review. Okay, so guys, I'm going to try and keep the review quite short as I don't want to blab on for too long and seeing how good he is and all that. But no spoiler, this guy is ridiculous. Honestly, he's probably the best card I've used this year, just straight off the bat. Oh my god, this guy is amazing. I originally never used about four or five chemistry styles on him to try and find the best one. And the best one is Hunter. I found Deadeye, if you've not got the money for Hunter, but I imagine if you do get Michael Ballack, you probably have got the money for him. Um, Deadeye is also a very chemistry style for him. Now, I'm going to show you how many calls this guy got for me, right? Playing as a cam, and I'll show you the team I've used around him. This is infant champions and a couple in divides. I think he plays four or five games in divides. One friendly got no goals against him anyway. It was like, we literally rage quit at seven, um, seventh minute because yeah. But look at that: fifty-four goals, fifteen assists, and forty-three games. Now this guy, I'm not abusing him in the slightest, right? I never abuse a new card. If I do abuse him for the first game, maybe. But other than that, I tried to use him as I would use a normal card because I was looking to review this guy and. Yeah, this guy is the best card I've used in the game. He's an end game card to start off with. Look at them stats. This guy's honestly insane. Six foot two. Medium high work rates, which for some people will like because obviously if you want Balak, right, chances are you got a lot of coins. So if you've got a full icon team, this guy probably is better off as a defensive player. But if he's your main man in your team, this guy can do absolutely anything. I've played him at striker for two games, eight goals in two games for striker. I played him CDM, I played him CM, I played him CAM. You can play anywhere i mean obviously we're looking at stats he can probably play anywhere as a defensive player i recommend using either sentinel or shadow as an attacker player i would definitely recommend hunter as a standing midfielder use him in deadeye deadeye is honestly perfect for this card right this is the team i used them around this is a pretty solid team if you ask me i mean it's pretty nice but it's a hard it's a hard okay to be honest but i'm gonna review him but looking at that uh i don't know look, not really looking to review that guy the link very savage as well got a bit of a boost now now the in-game the team looks like that right balak plays here right and if you do want to play him as a cam i'll play him there with gareth bale at cm gareth bale does work at cm and this team works pretty well but it's not about the team it's about an individual player what can this guy do i'm gonna get into the clips and honestly this is all well half of it is for champions some of it was a different team this team is still pretty new and we've only played Four games with it. Um, Balak has played four games in Div Division Rivals. This is all the games I play with them. Honestly, you want to look at some of these goals and think, okay, this guy is worth. You know, when you look at a card for two million coins, right? I would never see any card in the game is worth two million coins. But when you actually use them, then you start to realize, okay, this guy's worth two million coins. I got this guy for 600k. I shit you not, I got him for 600k. I packed 92 Modric. I packed. I, and I used, I used a 91 Cruise. I was going to use that 91 on Dosky, but I kept him just in case. 600k, I used the Prime Haji, that's why I got him for cheaper. 600k is what this guy cost me, and seriously, oh my god. It is the best deal I've ever had in FIFA in my entire life. I mean, there's not a single, that's like over, that's over, over exaggerating it. This generally is the best deal I've ever had in the game. I'm going to show you some of the clips, right? And you're not going to believe how good this guy is. Seriously. As we look at Balak, oh my god, some of the clips he got for me were absolutely amazing. People say Van Dyke is the best at the back of the game. He didn't care. Look at that. Out strength Van Dyke, out run Van Dyke. Not many people can do that in this game. And you no, know, when you think Balak, what what are you like? Are you a defensive midfielder? Are you a striker? He just says, well, you know, I'm a bit of um, I'm a bit of everything. I can shoot, and I'm very very good at shooting, and I can do skill moves. I can do absolutely everything. Now, unfortunately, I have not got many clips with this guy, considering how many goals I actually got with him. It's all my stuff has just disappeared. I thought I recorded like a hundred thousand billion clips, right? But nah. Oh, I've got this from the Xbox record thing because I'm not recording, I'm recording more clips, so I just want to get this out as fast as I can. But that's all I've got for the clips. But as a top points, this guy, this guy, people want to say, is he a buy? Was he a nah? Well, I think I've answered your question here today, boys. This guy is 100% buy. Put your whole club into this guy. Seriously, this guy, if you just start your club again, he being a main man, if he was like your road to glory guy, this is the man. This is the main guy. I can't imagine a player getting much better than this guy. Whether it's Prime Ronaldo, Prime Vieira. Now, I used Prime Vieira last year. I used Prime Hullet last year. I've used plenty of players like that. I think Balak honestly comes on top of all of them. Prime Vieira is like... This guy is like Prime Vieira, but defensive. And things you can do more than Prime Vieira. I think this guy is better than Prime Vieira, if I'm honest. Obviously, in comparison to last year's gameplay, but you, sort of, you can sort of tell the difference. This guy is better than Prime Vieira, in my opinion. He's better than Prime Hullet, in my opinion. Prime Hullet was obviously amazing. But this guy is something else. He's... 
he is the pretty much the most meta player I've ever used in FIFA in my entire life. So that's not even a joke. That's not even like over exaggeration. This guy is genuinely amazing. Now people, the reason I took a while to get this review out because people have been saying, you, like, for example, the Chicharito review, right? I got so much, so much hate for that. Like I ain't like the card. So and after a while, I thought the card was alright. I didn't use him enough. Fair enough, but. I'm going to start using cards for at least 20 games now, so that's it. if that means reviews don't come out as often or um, they're very, very late, it's because of this, because I'm trying to use use the card for enough to sort of get actual feel for it. 20 games plus, I'm trying to use them for. But that's literally it for the review. If you guys did enjoy it or you're going to go buy them, make sure to tell me below. Leave a comment below, subscribe, and yeah, peace.